football has a concussion problem, but engineers at UAB have come up with a unique solution. The best way to make the game safer, argues UAB's Dean Sicking, is to improve the helmets. But that isn't easy with the current testing method, which involves dropping helmets onto a hard surface. That tells you if a helmet protects against skull fractures, but it doesn't answer a crucial question. How well does it protect a player from concussion? Sicking is well known in safety circles. He designed the Safer Barrier, which has dramatically reduced injuries in NASCAR racing. Now his team is using the same techniques to build a better football helmet. The first thing they did was analyze thousands of hours of game film in order to isolate the most dangerous hits on the football field. Then, using custom-designed software, they measured all the factors involved, including speed and collision angles. Armed with that information, Sicking's team is now hard at work in a unique lab at Birmingham's Barber Motorsports Park. They're using crash test dummies from the auto industry, fitted with special sensors to recreate the hits they've documented on game film. By recreating these impacts over and over again with different helmets, the researchers can test how well each design protects players from head injuries. The goal is to rank all the helmets currently on the market, giving players, parents, and coaches the data to make an informed choice. UAB's testing system will also help designers create new helmets that offer even better protection.